Hello, my name is Kate and here is a Poundland haul. It's probably the biggest haul I've ever done of any hauls, of Poundland hauls, car boot sales hauls. I've got so much to show you. I've got it all stacked around me. I've kind of been saving it up over the last couple of weeks because last week um, there was a Poundland outfit challenge. I'll link that below in case you didn't see it. Um, me and Mr. Carrington, another lovely YouTuber, we went to Poundland, Pep and Co and bought each other an outfit. So if you want to see what we bought, um, have a look at the video. I shall link it in the description below. But I'm gonna show you everything I found. Um, there is so much stuff. So get yourself a cup of tea or coffee or drink or festive I don't know some mulled wine and I'll get started if you haven't subscribed yet make sure you do and um, if you enjoy the video you can like it but you know you'll probably do that at the end I'm gonna show you my mug of the day before I get stuck in and I'm gonna try and be as quick as I can because there's lots to go through or get through this is my mug of the day and it is also from Poundland I think quite a few people have this it's just so cute look at it with all the little um, Christmassy things on I love the colours as well, it's really nice. So this is my Poundland mug of the day. And I've got a coffee, you might have seen this um, in Vlogmas Day 19, because um, that was when I filmed this Poundland haul. Well, I'm filming it now, obviously, but this is gonna be on in the, in the future. I'm gonna go quite quickly because there's so much to get through and I'm gonna try and edit as little as possible because there isn't enough time at the minute because of Vlogmas. Okay, so the first item is this little tinsel. Little, well, it's kind of, it's fine tinsel and you get oh, five meters, five meters of fine tinsel. So I shall put that out. I haven't put it out yet. I've been saving it for the haul. So that's the first item. And then I got quite a few cushions and I've been saving these as well. So I'll dot them about the house um, after I've done this haul. And um, this one obviously says, baby, it's cold outside. And I've got the little travel mug as well to match it. It's a cute little cushion. And then I bought another one of these because I really, really like the black and white with the little tree. I've also got one behind me there, but they go quite nicely together on the couch. So that's that one. And then the last cushion is a little like reindeer one, which is very sweet as well. Um, a red, and this one feels like a bit um, squidgier than the others. So that they're all a pound each. Okay, I got one of these, a Christmas uh, tinsel wreath. That was a pound. I think everyone's kind of bought these and done like amazing DIYs, but I will probably just keep it as it is and just stick it somewhere on the wall, which I will do in a minute. I also got some Saint-Tropez fake tan. Um, everything is a pound so far. I'll let you know when um, a couple of the items are two pounds and a lot were reduced. There's a lot of bargains in this haul. So um, if you need any more like stocking stuffers, is that the word? Like little presents for people. They've got some really good toys, which I'll show you soon, that have been um, reduced from five pounds to two pounds. But anyway, that was a pound for the Sandra Pay. I got some more of these pens because I love them. A pound for the set of three, but I've bought these kind of all year long, but they're, they're really nice. And they're nice to write with as well. Um, I picked up some Prosecco gummies or jellies. These are boiled sweet, not gummies or jellies at all boiled sweets and you get 125 grams but they'd make a really nice little present for somebody i think i'm gonna keep these because i just i think they're very cute um so they were a pound uh, of oh notepads notebooks oh no drop something um a couple of notebooks these have got pineapples on i might have to give these away as a present because i bought a lovely notebook from tk maxx the other day um and all oh, these are sweet aren't they they've got mar just marble pattern on the front and the back and you get a set of two and they're slightly different. So some lovely little notebooks in Poundland. I've seen these candles a few times in Poundland and I, and I haven't bought them, but I thought I would and I will keep them for kind of January because they're not Christmassy, are they? But they're just very nice. That one says good vibes only and let the adventures adventure begin. So a pound each for those and I'll probably keep those um, and use them in January because I've got a lot of like Christmas candles to use at the minute. Now these were a pound. You might have already seen these in Poundland. They were reduced from two pounds down to a pound. These glitter baubles and they kind of look like snowballs, some of them, um, if you can see that. And then there's a sort of glittery white ones with a sort of uh, greeny glitter in, if that's showing like an iridescent glitter and the others are silver. So I got two of those, a set for me and a set for my mum because we need to put some more um, baubles on her Christmas tree. And talking of baubles, you might have seen this in Poundland. It was originally five pounds. And then the other day when I was in Kings Lynn Poundland in Norfolk, it was down to two pounds. So it's a Bluetooth bauble speaker and it just says attach me to your Christmas tree. And I thought that was brilliant. So I'm gonna attach that to the Christmas tree and it needs, it's got a rechargeable battery in it. I'll work it out, I'll use it and probably show it in the vlog, but brilliant for two pounds. So the Christmas tree can like sing you songs, which is always nice. And these were a pound, some clear fairy lights, 
50 of them and they were reduced from two pounds to one pound and i got a few more of these jo malone poundland dupes this is the room spray and when i showed this before people thought it was body spray they've been using it as body spray but this yeah it's room spray and i think this is the nicest fragrance it's called red fruits and you get how many how much 100 milliliters i love it i think it's such a nice scent and i got one more candle the basil and lime and i think that's the nicest out of all the candles that's my like favorite scent it is lovely. I bought a few more of these box candles for gifts at Christmas and these look, I think these look really expensive as well. I think you probably pay like three pounds in even Primark for one of these um, and they're a pound each for all of those and they've all got different scents. This one is, what are you? Vanilla, wild berries and zen garden so I think they're brilliant if you need some little presents for people just a pound each of these candles are lovely and they come in a little box which is always nice isn't it I think these are brilliant value for a pound little cactus vases they're not little they're the size of my head they're quite big actually and maybe Mr Carrington can have one although he might already have one he probably does if not my friend Louise can have the other and I will keep this one because it's just quite sweet maybe put it in our new bedroom or in our new bathroom these look so cute and actually they look quite expensive Expensive, don't they? They're little marshmallow donuts. They obviously look like they're real, but they're just marshmallow. Just a very sweet little um, gift, you know, a little stocking stuffer. And I also got this little brooch, which I'm probably going to wear like maybe tomorrow. It's a flashing brooch with a little angel on it. This giant stocking was originally two pounds, but it was reduced to a pound in my pound land today. So I grabbed one of those so I can put um, Toby's presents in there. And I've also got an apology to make for this next item. A while ago, I said it didn't smell very nice um, when I smelt it in the bottle and then I used it and it smelt amazing. So I'm really sorry, Frosted Pine and Apple Comfort Creations, because when you smell it, it doesn't smell like, it smells okay, but it doesn't smell like blow you away. And then when you use it in the washing machine, it's really nice. So yes, I can re recommend this now because um, it just, I don't know, it's much better when you actually use it. So sorry about that comfort. I had to get some more and make a public apology. Tea bags for a pound um, because we've run out of tea bags. And then these are amazing and they were three for two, one pound each. So I got three sets because I can probably like link them up, maybe like bunting, Christmas bunting. So little glitter bottle lights, a set of 10, and I bought three of them. So they were two pounds for the three, which is brilliant, isn't it? And nearly all the Christmas decorations in Poundland, the one pound items were all three for two, but just double check at the till because some of mine didn't come up. So I had to go back in, but luckily the um, people in Gapton, they're so nice, everyone who works there. So I have to say thank you very much to um, everyone in Gapton. And the manager there knows I do these Poundland hauls. So he said, um, make sure you stay on the vlog that we were helpful. And I was like, of course I will. I always Always say how good my local Poundland is and also hi to Ryan because I think Ryan um, I don't know if he watches um, but he told the manager that I do some Poundland hauls anyway I picked up some of these for a pound because Toby um, loves them so you might have seen that in the vlog the other day he thinks these are the best crackers ever and keeps wanting to open them oh this is new well I haven't seen it before it might not be new but it's new to me Twin Peaks purple one and this is milk chocolate with, bleh, i'll say that again milk chocolate with fruit nut and nougat so a new twin peaks but you have to be careful everyone keeps saying <laughs> they are really hard to bite but once you eat them they are really nice i wonder what they'd be like melted down if they um i bet they'd be really quite nice so a pound for that one i got two of those but i don't know where the other one's gone i haven't eaten it yet they had some amazing makeup in my pound land i had to walk away because it was just full of Bourgeois, Maybelline, L'Oreal, Revlon, Rimmel, just so much. And I've, you know, if you've been watching my hauls, I do have quite a bit of makeup, but I had to get these because I just, I couldn't leave them behind. So we just got a few bits. Look at that, that is really nice colors and they're quite Christmassy as well. And then the other one I got was similar, but it's kind of more blues if you can see that. So I had to get the two of those for a pound. And then I got some L'Oreal lip gloss the other day and that's like a shimmery, kind of an orangey colour which would be lovely I think for January well I suppose it's an autumn colour but that would be really nice and um, I also picked up some Christmas plates because they're just nice aren't they to have a little sandwich on so I thought me and Toby could have a little lunch uh, a little picnic with these and Lee obviously Lee Lee my other half you can have a picnic too and a little tinsel um what's this called like a snowflake thing tinsel decoration and this is also in the three for two um items but i've not seen that before i think that's really sweet 
This was also reduced from five pounds to two pounds. It's a disco ball and it's got a like a hanger thing on it. So you could use this as a giant ball ball. So I thought that was brilliant. So I had to get one of those um, for two pounds and I got a few toys. As you can probably hear, I think these are amazing. It's not for Toby, it's for my niece Anae, and I got one for my other niece Molly. Um, it's, what's it called? A wish granter. So you get a little genie lady and then you put her inside and you press the button and it grants you a wish. I'd have loved that when I was younger. So I got two of these and they were reduced from, yeah, reduced from five pounds to two pounds. More wrapping paper to wrap up um, all of these presents. That's so cute, isn't it? lovely with a little um mouse soldier person on a little ballerina and this is the huge like extra long wrapping paper with the snowmen on and that mr carrington showed and i had to go and get it and this one's lovely a little more luxury it's called luxury wrapping paper with the little houses on i think kath kidston did one uh, like this a few years ago and i really like that too this might be a bit daft but i got it for lee like when he goes on his like stag do's and stuff it was two pounds down from five a drinks helmet so you can or you can always put your like coca-cola in there and walk around being nice and hydrated and this was two pounds for this led tree topper and i think we're going to put this on our tree because our um star at the top is a bit rubbish and this one's going to light up so i think toby will love that so five pounds down to two and um if your kids or someone you know um and you're looking for a little Christmas gift likes cars and um, this one lights up so I'm going to save this for a birthday present for one of Toby's friends who loves cars so it, it was two pounds again down from five and it lights up and I don't know if it makes noise. oh it does it makes noises plays music and it lights up so I'll put that away for Toby's friend who is car mad and obviously I'll get him a few other things as well right I've got oh the end is in sight of the Poundland Hall I've got a few more things stashed in the big that's Hall Folks bag. These look really good. They're a pound each. Um, Colgate Sensitive Pro Relief and you get like a tube of stuff. Um, my These are for Lee's mum and dad who have sensitive teeth. They always use that Sensodyne stuff. So that might look a bit weird, but I think they'll like that as a little present, something useful. So I'm gonna wrap those up for them. They were a pound each. And I got this for my mum. It's just a little shopping list like memo pad and I really like the colours of that so that's for my mum. As I said earlier on the makeup selection was so good so I did buy a few more things. This is a Maybelline Brow Drama Crayon for your eyebrows so I do need that kind of thing because I always put eyeliner on my eyebrows and I, you're probably not meant to but that might help me out make my brows look better and I also got a Maybelline Colour Drama Intense Lip Paint. So we'll see what that's like. And that is in Never Bear. They had so many different shades, but I was good and I just got the one. And if you need any makeup, always check Poundland first if you know yours does sell makeup. I think most of them do, but the one that I go to is just always full of brilliant makeup. Um, so check there before you go off to like Boots or any bit, anywhere because you might find it a bit cheaper. Um, I also got some deodorant because I'm gonna need it for Christmas because I'm doing Vlogmas and sweating a bit. Um, got some Smarties for Toby, so I'll wrap those up. I got Rufus a little Christmas present, Rufus the dog. A little squeezy toy and a couple of other bits, so I'll wrap those up for Rufus. And I think that's it. Is that everything? Yes, it is. That is everything I've got to show you. That is my huge, ginormous, Poundland haul so I hope you enjoyed it I don't know how much I spent I think it was like 50 or 60 quid so quite a lot of money but I have been saving stuff up the last couple of weeks and if you did enjoy the video give it a like and if you haven't subscribed yet make sure you do and I will speak to you soon vlogmas day 21 is tomorrow isn't it so this is vlogmas day no what day is it hey google what's the day today 19th it is wednesday the 19th of december 2018 so that means Friday is the 21st, that is, and then Saturday is 22nd, Christmas Eve is Monday, Christmas Day is Tuesday, it's all like going so fast. Thank you so much for watching, I hope you enjoyed the video, and if you did, give it a like, and make sure you subscribe as well. So that is it. This is going to be my final um, Poundland haul for the year, because after Vlogmas, I'm going to take a week um, just to be with Toby and Liam to enjoy like the holidays, so that's what we're going to do um, after Vlogmas, and have, have a little rest. And then next year, I'm going to do things slightly differently. I'll still do Poundland hauls, but what I'm going to do is a vlog for Monday, maybe a vlog for Wednesday or Thursday, 
might do Wandering Wednesdays. Thank you very much if that was you that suggested Wandering Wednesdays, like when I go out and about in Norfolk and visit some little towns and go in the charity shops and have a little bit of lunch. So that might be, yeah, Wednesday or probably Thursday I'll put that on. Um, and then I'm gonna do a haul on a Friday. So it either will be like car boot sale, charity shop, pound land so or home bargains so every friday will be a haul but it might be um, a charity shop one or a pound land one um but knowing me i always buy quite a bit so i'll chuck in an extra haul here and there so there'll definitely be videos monday and friday and then i will start doing the wandering wednesdays and um, probably a couple of weeks into january because i'm looking forward i think that'll be a really nice um vlog actually going to see a little different town and visiting and showing you and taking you with me vlogmas day 22 will be here tomorrow at seven o'clock and if you want to watch today's i uploaded that at five o'clock hopefully i did if future me um was organized so thanks for watching i'm gonna go i've drunk all my coffee because this was such a long haul i never drink all my coffee so i'm gonna have to go make another one thank you very much merry Christmas, Happy New Year, and I will speak to you soon. Bye, thank you. And thank you so much for watching these Poundland hauls. I've been doing it all this year. I did one, I think, every week for a year, and I've, I loved it. It was great fun, apart from when I went on holiday. I didn't do a haul. Um, but yeah, I have loved doing them. I love Poundland, and uh, thank you so much. If you've watched these hauls, if you've commented, if you've subscribed, it means so much to me. Have a lovely Christmas, and I'll speak to you soon. Bye, see you.